Can an average person like me make a better prank show than John Quinones? The answer is yes, because he agreed to take a picture with me after I showed him my work. And the work that I did to get to this point, I beat him at his own game. Now I know that John Quinones makes a multi-million dollar prank show with tons of social experiments, but I've never made a social experiment myself. So is that really a fair comparison? No. So I decided to make my own. First, I found a subject and asked him a pretty simple question. What's your name? Raymond. Hi Raymond. If I fell on the street, would you help me up? Uh, yeah. Are you just saying that? No, I think I would. So naturally I did what John would have liked me to do, and I tested him. All right guys, so Raymond just said he'd help me up. We actually see him sitting at a table right there. So we're gonna see what he would do if I fell over. But twist is, he knows I'm a perverted artist. Oh, oh. Yeah, I'm fine. Yeah, thank you, thank you. Thank you for helping me out. Yeah. As a gift, I'll pay you $5. No, 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 no need, man. The subject didn't do anything. And was my experiment better than any of John's experiments? I don't know. But when I showed him my work, he agreed to take a picture with me.